and in this video I'm going to uh, uh, answer the question here how to uninstall a plugin from a WordPress website uh, when it won't reinstall from the WordPress admin panel so I'm going to go log into a website and show you what uh, the problem is and how to solve this problem all right typically when you have a WordPress plugin you would go to the plugins and you'll see a list of your plugins here and there's active you can activate the plugin and you can deactivate the plugin when you deactivate the plugin it then be, it has a button that says delete and typically when you click the delete button it will uh, delete the plugin from this panel here or you could check here check the plugin that you want to delete and then click delete up here and hit apply but in some cases uh, the plugin doesn't actually delete so I'm gonna go into my cPanel and actually I'm gonna use FileZilla and you can get FileZilla from FileZilla uh, dash let me bring it down here FileZilla-project.org that's FileZillaProject.org and download it and I'm going to open mine up and uh, show you in just a second okay so this is my um, FileZilla uh, FTP client and basically what you do is you come over here and you you uh, you add your your FTP information uh, you should get this when you get your web hosting so the web the FTP is FTP your website name and then you put normal and then you put your username and password in there and uh, hit connect and actually is a test connection button somewhere so you just hit connect and then you'll see a list show up in this window here on the right hand side you'll see a, a window show up and depending on your FTP connection it might go right to the root directory or in my case it went to the subroot so if you want to open the, the root directory you hit the public HTML folder alright alright in my case I have many different directories so the directory that my WordPress installation is in is called I am responsive then you go to WP content WP content and then you click on plugins folder alright the plugin that I want to delete from my website is called easy uh, uh, bootstrap shortcuts actually I'm gonna delete the ASCII ISMET okay ASCII ISMET plugin so I'm gonna delete that because I want to keep the other one <laughs> alright so what I do is I right click on it and I hit delete yes do I really want to delete it yes alright so it's deleting the files and all the subdirectories in that folder so it takes a little bit of time but that's what it's doing okay now I'm gonna go back to my uh, plugins directory and I'm gonna refresh the page reload it and as you see my ASCII met a plugin is now removed from my plugin directory and off my web server entirely so that's how you manually delete a plugin that won't uninstall from the dashboard here uh, again it, you try the delete button or check it and then hit delete up here and apply and see if either one of those works if not download the FileZilla client 
log into the FileZilla client, navigate to your plugins directory, which is under WP Content, WP Plugins, and then delete the folder that contains your plugin. Alright, till next time, this is Jeff with IMMasterminds.net.